So here's the um, stupid adhesive uh, sticker that the dealership put on there. That most dealers do this now. They want to put a badge of uh, of uh, ad advertising on your new vehicle. So basically, I'm going to show you how to remove it. First step, you want to get a trim removal tool like this, and then you want to kind of just pry under there. It's only glued on, so it should just pry off. Especially with as hot as it is right now in the summer in Phoenix, uh, it's over 100 degrees. You know, if you're doing this in the winter time in Minneapolis or something. It's probably best to heat up the glue by using a hair dryer or a heat gun. Um, you know, if you're using a heat gun, they can get over 500 degrees. So make sure that you keep it far enough away from the paint and from the plastic on this lens that you don't warp or melt or distort anything. And then once you've heated up the glue, um, it should just pry right off. And if there's any residue left behind, you can just go ahead and use something like WD-40, gasoline, uh, Gooby Gone gunk off any of those uh adhesive removers that they sell at like uh you know like at an auto parts store or home depot or whatever and uh, that should take care of it and then you can use some polishing compound and kind of just buff that out and you'll never be able to tell that there was anything there now i would suggest doing this when the truck is new because if you leave it on there for a long long time what happens is the sun will actually distort the paint color around it so when you take it off you'll still be able to see it that happened to me on a truck that i had uh, not the last truck that I traded in, but the, the one before that, and it was 10 years old. And so when I took the uh, body paneling off, when I debadged it, you could really see where it was before. And it was, you know, I thought that I should have left it on after I took it off. But um, anyway, it's pretty simple. So this is the before, and I'll show you the after. All right, so here it is. I took off the uh, Larry Van Tile Van GMC sticker that was on here. And if you look... I just used a little bit of polishing compound and it took all the residue off. You can't even tell it was on there. All I used was a body trim removal tool uh, and you know, it didn't scratch the paint or anything. It's meant for something like this. And then just a little bit of turtle wax polishing compound and a microfiber cloth and it looks like uh, they never put it on. So real easy and you can use this process for any of these badging. like. The Sierra or the GMC Denali, if you want to debadge your truck, uh, which I'm not going to do, uh, you can use the same process. Just heat it up with uh, a hair dryer, unless of course you live in Death Valley or Phoenix, and uh, it'll be hot enough. You can just pull it off, use some of that uh, Gooby Gone, and then use some polishing compound and a microfiber, and that's about it. There you go.